Hi guys, it's Sean Rangi here. Hope you're doing very well. So, today's video is very, very quick and a must watch because it is smoked weed, experiencing depersonalization, derealization. Then you are not alone, okay? You are not alone. I apologize for that hammering, <laughs> but you are not alone. Okay, so I heard a wonderful acronym today about depersonalization, derealization, which I just had to share with you. The word is bald. B A L D. <laughs> not the most glamorous, uh, exciting word. But not that there's anything wrong with going bald, contrary to what the London Underground advertising will tell you. Anyway, so B. B. Calm. Okay. Depersonalization, derealization isn't fatal. You're not going to die from it. Okay. You, you'll, you'll be okay. A, acceptance, okay? Every time you don't accept a phenomena in your consciousness, your amygdala center, fear center grows and becomes more powerful. Um, just a, a little note there, 40 minutes of Vipassana, which is mindfulness meditation a day, 40, um, shrinks your amygdala in half after a while, your fear center. Uh, which is a pretty cool, pretty cool fact. So don't fight it, feel it, as a as Primal Scream, <laughs> as Primal Scream put it on their song "Don't Fight It, Feel It" on their album "Screamadelica," which was written for psychedelic experience and is a good. If you're going to stick with an album, apparently that's a good one to uh, to go with. So, did you ever read the story about the cat that got bigger with every step you took running away from it because you you were terrified of the death? Just kept getting bigger and bigger. Problems are like that, you know? Um, Depersonalization is like that. Derealization is uh, like that. The less you accept something, the, 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 what, you, what you fight persists, what you resist persists, persists. Again, very easy to talk the talk. But it's true, you know? And when you can manage it, um, it, really, it really helps. You could even try and re reverse psychologize yourself and, and learn to love your depersonalization and derealization. Viktor Frankl, who wrote Man's Search for Meaning, <laughs> he was a brilliant psychiatrist, specialist, um, put in four different concentration camps during the Nazi Germany era, um, said that, so he's learned a bit about suffering, and he was an expert psych psychiatrist before that. He said, reverse psychologize yourself. So in this case, I want to feel as depersonalized as possible. I want to feel as derealized as possible. I want to feel as depersonalized as possible. I want to feel as derealized as possible. I want to feel as depersonalized as possible. I want to feel as derealized as possible. Is this all you've got? God, existence, providence, universe, whatever you are. Stim uh, stimulation. Freudian slip or Freudian slip. Simulation. Is this all you've got? This level of depression or anxiety or depersonalization, agoraphobia or stress or, you know, whatever it is that's uh, hammering away at you. So, <laughs> L is for laugh. Um, a state of calmness is released <laughs> through hammers and it is honestly more serious than that, endorphins through laughing after a comedy show or, or anxiety is also reduced by eating because of the um, endorphins as you, you know you can feel a bit sat <laughs> satisfied and drowsy uh, when you hear when you hear constant hammering um, <laughs> laugh out loud and I cannot believe I just I just said that I apologize to to anyone with integrity out there Okay, D. We've done B, we've done A, we've done L. This, this is D of bald. Stop stagnating and, th and throw yourself into a meaningful activity because it not only takes your mind off the DPDR, it takes, it takes the, it, it fills up the baggy feeling you've got. It, 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 it makes more satisfying that um, sense of waste and, uh, and wasteful pain that you've got, you know? Um, you can shape the world for positive action. It's a, it's a cliche, but it is true. If you go out today and shoot 50 people in the face, you're going to have done, I would say objectively, a worse thing than if you'd gone out and complimented, in a, you know, in a, in a non-contrived way, 50 people in the street. You know? Um, action. Positive goals, patience, wisdom, um, the more time you've got, no, the less time you've got, the more time you realise you haven't got. But the more time you realise you need to take over things, which is a very strange paradox. 
So, this video has been exactly five minutes. Thank you for making it so necessary for me um, to make it. <laughs> Thank you for watching it. Um, stay productive, guys. Don't let these symptoms destroy your life, okay? Deal with them. There are ways of dealing with them. Take it easy. Bye-bye.